I cannot believe the moment is finally here. We've been talking about this fucking trip since last year. I'm actually really excited to go this time. I mean, I was excited last year, but I just, I'm going to pray over our trip. I'm going to ask Jesus to allow us to have a beautiful trip. I'm so thankful to have a friend like you to travel with. London, Paris, 2024. We are ready, baby. Guys, we are going back to London, baby. This is our starter shop. We're at the airport. Cheers! I'm about to do this. Because I haven't eaten anything since breakfast time. into town. We had time to even stop and get a coffee. So far, so great. It's like seven o'clock in the morning. Seven o'clock behind Kiara, please, on the platform number one. Please stand in behind Kiara, number one, the train now running into the town. I'm just trying to make it up. Amy's with her, so. I got you. Our stop is the next stop, so. We get to the to be baby. All right, we are about to drop our bags here. It's 10 o'clock here in London, and our check-in isn't until three. See, 10, 13. So this is at the train station um, and they charge. We're gonna do the second option because uh, our check-in's not till three and it's 10. So we're gonna need it for a little bit longer. But yeah, it's pretty cheap, pretty affordable. And we're gonna leave our bags here. We're getting ready to go to the little thing. I did my makeup halfway on the train and this is what you get for doing your makeup on a train. It's not like blended correctly, but it's okay. <laughs> Um, yeah, I need to put on like some lip liner and some lipstick, girl, I'm just looking crazy. But um, yeah, we're really excited to be in London for the second summer in a row. And yeah, I have a, I have a good feeling about this one. I feel really confident. We are at this restaurant called Oaxaca. Just about to get some drinks. Just left PLT. This is how it looks on the inside. What are you doing? Working. Doing what? Drinking. But what are you doing on your phone? Oh. Contracts. <laughs> Cheers! Oh, <laughs> damn it! <laughs> All right, this is our room. We're staying at the Numa in Bloomsbury. It's quaint. It's very cute, just for us. Just me and my camp cam. <laughs> See if we got a view. Probably not, but. All right, we have a little street view. Not much to see, but some construction. However. We're in a really cute neighborhood, and we are happy. Yeah. Cute bathroom. Very cute. Have to take turns getting ready in here. It is tiny, but it's nice. So, we have made it to the hotel, obviously. Um, the room is, I would say perfect size for us. It's perfect size for what we need. We are about to take so, we're about to take a shower um, and go get some food. We have not eaten since this morning, and we didn't even have a real breakfast. When we first got here at like seven, we got like matcha, and I got like an almond croissant. Then later, I had like some fruit, and then we went to this um, taco place after we went to PLT and got um, drinks. So we really haven't eaten a proper meal. I'm hungry. So today, since it's hot, since the weather is beautiful, we're gonna find some rooftops to go to and just enjoy the weather in London. This time last year, you guys, it was not, it was not this. The sun was not shining. I think we got one 
partly sunny day and that was it. So we're really gonna enjoy the London sun. We do have a few friends here who we've met on our uh, journey and on our trip last year. So we're gonna link back up with them. And um, I don't know, everyone's just trying to like tell us what to do. Like, oh, you guys should go here, you guys should go here, blah, blah, blah. Like we only here for three days. So um, yeah, I'm just, I have no expectations for this uh, this trip to London. I'm just here on vibes and I'm here to have a good time. So yeah, I'm gonna take a shower, do my hair, get cute, and then we will reconvene when I get cute. Okay. Guys, we are ready to go. This is my outfit. I'm gonna let you guys can see it. I'll get in the mirror. Um, we're gonna go eat some food. I want good food, so we're gonna try to eat at this Indian place. Um, I have no idea what like they sell or if the food is good. I was recommended this place by a friend. So we are gonna go there and then we're just gonna try to be outside for the rest of the day. That's the plan. We are going to the club tonight, so that'll be late, late, later. Let me guys, let me show you guys Kaylee. That's her little fit there. Very cute, so she cutie. We're doing the Capri thing. And that's mine. We're going for like super like, I don't even, what is this style? What is this aesthetic? Mm, like, it's giving 20s. Okay. All fashion trends come back around, just so you guys know. So we are wearing Capris again. And kitten heels. Well, mine aren't that kitty today. <laughs> Oh, yeah, going off for a very late lunch. And we are walking to dinner. Kami's right there. We did not intend to walk, but every Uber that we called kept can't or Uber is not working right now. So, but the place is like half a mile away. So, we walk it. And it's fine. This food better be good. We walked half a mile for it. That's all I gotta say. Carry on. Carry on. I'm trying to find it. Oh, they have a shuttle mat. It's a cute, like, background. Good morning, London. It's day two. Cam's here. Hello. We're going to go to this restaurant called Nessa's. I looked it up on TikTok and it looks amazing. We just want a little, a little bite to eat. A little yeah, mimosa. Too crazy. You know what I mean? It's Saturday. Yeah. So yeah, we're excited. We're hungry. We had a interesting turn of events last night. <laughs> we ended up in the house watching Matilda. So there's that. <laughs> but um we are trying to go out again tonight. We need to pack up our room because we have an early train in the morning. So before we go out, we're gonna like clean the room, pack all our shit, and then go out and then come back. So Nessus will be cute. I can feel it. And we ain't taking no Ubers. We walk in. We got comfortable shoes on today. Let me show you. Happy day two in London. It's 7 p.m. and I'm sorry I haven't updated the vlog since earlier. Um, what did we do today? 
Nothing really. We woke up, we went to brunch at a place called Ness's. Very, very cute. And then we changed clothes, took pictures, and now we're here at this place. And this is Persian food, so we're talking like kebabs, rice, hummus, falafel, ganoush. Yeah. We will let you guys know how the food tastes. Hello, you guys. This is night two of Monday. We are getting ready to go out. Don't know where we'll end up, but when in Rome, we're gonna check out this shisha place and then hopefully go to the club because we look so cute and we're just trying to have fun on one of the last nights here. We have a train ride to Paris in the morning. I don't know about Cam, but I'm hella excited to go to Paris. This is both of our first times. And we're having a great time in London. It's been very relaxing. We've been chilling, taking content. Yeah, just doing normal stuff. How you feel, Cam? <laughs> she gave us a thumbs up. So yeah, I'm probably gonna bring the camera with us so you guys can see what we've been doing. Hi guys, we made it to Cali. We are on the metro right now, going to our Airbnb. Let's see how Kami feels about the trip so far. Yeah. Besides me getting sick, I am having a great time. I'm trying to convince her to buy some fucking cold medicine. She get refuses. Better and get cute. Here we go. Paris. Tell them about the luggages. Uh, four flights of stairs, y'all. Luckily, this nice family helped us out at the they last did. staircase. They did. And that was the longest staircase, too, so I'm glad they did. So funny. Yeah. We're debating if we want to buy metro oh, passes. Because we think it'll be cheaper to just do that than to keep buying individual tickets. Oh, but it's, it's calm so far. I'm excited. I I'm excited. How many rides you get off the head? On this one ticket, yeah. I'm shaking because I'm so hungry. But I found these nuts in my bag. I also feel like I need to throw up. That's another thing. But I'm also just hungry. So I like to be that. We are so tired. <laughs> I just want to go to sleep. Do you want to go to sleep? But when in Rome, do as the Romans do. So we're going to make the best of it. We got here dumb late. Dumb, stupid late. But. It's still light outside. I think it's seven o'clock. So we're gonna do a little hokey pokey. 
Let's go get in the shower. Hello there. We have made it to Paris. We're in a substation. Period. And we're going to dinner. Our outfits are so cute. Let me show you hands. Wow, cowgirl. This is me. Thanks, Betty. Cute, yeah. <laughs> All right, we are at Perouche. I got the chicken with mashed potatoes. I said I wanted um, pasta, but maybe we'll get our pasta tomorrow because this sounded really good. And then Cam got seasonal vegetables with, what kind of fish is that? Uh, she got fish. I don't know what kind it is. Yeah, girl, don't give me the line. This is the moment of truth. First bite. This is our first, first food in Paris. So let's see if they, see if they ate. All right, let's see if they ate. That's what they're saying. That's what they're saying. First bite, tender. It's not dry. I think this is a chicken breast. So that's. Yeah. Being said, I wish it was a chicken thigh. Because I feel like the sauce would have absorbed into the meat a little bit better. I feel like you have to scoop up the sauce to get that, you know what I mean, flavor. Mm. But it is not bad. Overall, rating. I'll give it a seven. Seven. Mm. Mashed potato. It's mashed potato. That's a real potato that they mash. Because it's thick. So it is real. It's thick. Mm. Hello. Yeah. About 7.5. You guys made it back to the B and B. Just had dinner. It was delicious. We're gonna do a little impromptu photo shoot and go to bed. You know my ex cause he validate me. You know but check, I don't wanna risk me. I ain't get possessed, let my space speak freely. Hey, my past can't escape me. Why pussy precedes me? Why my how the time change? I'm still playing the Good morning guys. We are day two in Paris. We're supposed to be out and about. Getting our content done. Kami got sick somehow. So she's been um, struggling the past two days, I'll say. But it is 9.29 and I am ready to go. Um, this morning I want to go to like a cute little cafe and take some pics and then um, obviously eat and then start our content for today. I have been watching like so many TikToks. Hang on. I've been watching so many TikToks about like best places to take pictures, places to eat, stuff like that. So um, we're going to find a cute little cafe and we're going to go eat and then take pics like by the Apple Tower and do all the touristy stuff. So this is our last full day in Paris. I guess you can say tomorrow. We have tomorrow too, but we leave at like six and we have to be to the train station probably at like five something and we have to check out. So it's just, it's so much stuff, but we're going to try to make the most of today. I have dinner reservations at this restaurant called Gigi and it's a really like popular restaurant here in Paris and I'm actually really excited to go. It's at 10. So yeah, I'm excited. Oh, no. No. Thank you oh. for coming to the pharmacy. <laughs> Yo. Yeah, we are headed to Caret, which is a very famous cafe here in Cali. Hopefully, we get some good pictures. Hopefully, it's not too late because this place gets hella busy. We are gonna hope for the best.
here. Hi. We're right behind the Eiffel Tower and we are trying to fill out these forms because you need a QR code, which is like a pass, to visit certain areas uh, in Paris during the Olympic Games, which I knew about before. I thought they were bullshitting, but it's actually real. So we're just on the website now trying to get a pass. Yeah, let me show you guys. So the Eiffel Tower is just there. We're trying to take pictures right there. All right, y'all, we finally found a spot. This is Kami here. And um, this is where we are. We're gonna try to get some really cute pictures. Kenny is retouching her makeup. Day one, well day two of Paris is complete. We went all around the world in 180 days. We backpacked, we trekked, we hiked. Um, we met Quentin Tarantino and um, we made the best of what we had. Right now we're getting ready for dinner at Gigi's, but it's shot o'clock. So we're gonna take a little shot. And we're gonna get ready for our evening. This is my third outfit of the day. Top is from Fashion Nova. Skirt is from Shane. I don't have any shoes on. Wig is from uh, Wiggins Hair. This is 22 inches of Indian hair. It is gorgeous. It holds cowl. Hair has been curly all day. And shake that booty meat. Oh, hey, got, hey, 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 hey. Oh no, no diddy, no diddy. Hey. Hey guys, so we made it back to the house. It's our final night in Paris. And I'm honestly like feeling really bad because like we fumbled the bag so hard on our first day because we had like a full day like here. Like we're supposed to get here. We we're supposed to get here at it wasn't even that early to be honest like we we're supposed to be get, getting here at 12 and we ended up getting here at six well, it's kind of a big deal because that's like you can do a lot in six hours but like no regrets i had so much fun like we have all day tomorrow uh pretty much all day tomorrow to like figure out what we want to do most of the museums and uh museums and stuff are either blocked off or they're closed because of the olympics um, so you have to get a QR code to like answer certain parts and we apply for the QR code, but they were saying sometimes people get it in days, sometimes people get it in weeks, like, and some people have never gotten one, even though they put in an application. So it's like, you have to basically just be really lucky to, you know, get one either way. Um, to me, two days is not enough in Paris. Like it's really not today was great because we literally walked around the city um, all day and got some great content. I mean, even though we weren't allowed to like go up to like the really great spots of the Eiffel Tower and we didn't get to go to the Louvre because it was closed. Like it's just been long, like so much stuff. But um, I had a really great day. I think we got some great content. Um, yeah, so tomorrow 
I want to go to a museum. I'm hoping that one of them is open so we can go and get some more cute pics. And at six o'clock, we have to leave to go back to London. So yeah, we're definitely gonna be on our uh, on time for that train. So um, yeah, just being responsible adults. I want to come back to Paris so bad, like so, so bad. And I'm still here and I wanna come back. But um, it's been great. Like the people are really nice. Like we're staying in a really nice neighborhood. I know how to ride the metro now. So like, yeah, everything's been lovely. Like it's been really, really good. It's been great actually. And I can't wait to come back. So I will let you guys know what we're doing in the morning. And uh, yeah, bye. This is our breakfast this morning. This is a restaurant called Polo right by our Airbnb. We got a little avocado toast, eggs, can we be eating nothing? I don't know how she survives. That's something. No, it's not. <laughs> uh, happy Tuesday. It's our last day in Paris. Um, this morning has been a bit of a uh, little... Yeah. So we thought we'd have to check out 11. Check out was at 10. That's our friend right there. Um, so we were going to try to shoot some content. But I honestly believe we wouldn't have time to do that anyways because an hour is not enough time to shoot three, four, five outfits. Um, so anyways, got kicked out. And now we're at breakfast. But it started raining, so we're like, okay, let's see if we can go back to London early. So we're trying to do it online. They're trying to charge us like $166. We're not trying to pay. But we're also like kind of juggling like, should we just go back to the train station and like chance it and see if they'll like do it in person? We just don't want to pay extra money when it's supposed to be free. So then I suggested that we go to Palace of Versailles because that's what I wanted to do, but I didn't know if we would have time to do it. That's why I wasn't high on my priority list. Versailles is like not near us and it's not in Paris. It's literally in Versailles. So I go to buy the ticket. They're closed today. And I don't know if they're closed today or they're just closed because all the museums are saying just close, 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 close because of the Paris 24, the Olympics. So I'm like, okay. I don't know what else to do because everywhere's fucking closed. So I'm like, okay, let's just, maybe we can go to the mall because I wanted this little like little crop top. And I'm trying to find like a ratchet mall because yeah, these fancy malls are gonna have that type of clothing. So um, that's the only thing I have planned for today. Uh, if we can get back earlier, that'd be awesome. So we're not rushing to do things, um, but I just don't want to pay that money. You know what I mean? It's, it's just very risky. Maybe we can get on a phone call. Maybe that's what we should do. Because sitting here, yeah, is it ratchet though? Don't, it don't need to be fancy. No. Okay. Okay. So we got a confirmation on the mall. But um, what we're not gonna do is sit here and do like this because that's gonna drive me crazy. Um, so we're gonna figure out what we're gonna do after we leave the store. And um, if we leave early, we leave early. If we find into something like fun here, we'll do, like we're just like going with the flow today. Like we already have to plan another trip to Paris because this one has quite literally pissed us off <laughs> with the freaking Olympics. Um, how you feel? I'm good. I think we're we'll making do. We're pivoting. So what you have to do. Mm -hmm. What can you do, right? What can you do? But how did you enjoy Paris? Oh, I loved it. I loved it. We gotta come back, and we gotta come back and stay for the whole. Yeah, state. we have to stay longer. London, we love you, but Paris. Yeah, mm. Paris is a vibe. And like, so everyone who we told we were coming to Paris, they're like, oh my god, they're so rude, and like. Everyone's been so kind. Like, it's been so nice and like refreshing. Yeah. It's been great. No complaints. Zero. No complaints. All right, so we're going to the mall, I guess. Bye. <laughs> All right, guys. So, this is our last few moments in Paris. Um, I'm at this restaurant, it's Mexican restaurant. I don't know the name of it. But, anyways, just eating some little tacos before our train. Paris was amazing. We only got really one full day. So I definitely need to look into some flights back to Paris so I can finish my vacation so we can like see the monuments properly. We can go to the museums, we can go to Versailles, like 
this was like nothing. This was like a little teaser. And then we want to go shopping. We went to Franklin D. Roosevelt um, Boulevard. And there's just, they have every single designer store you could think of. So next time I'm definitely going to come prepared to stay a few more days in Paris. Um, I think we're still going to come back to London because it has like a special place in our heart. Like we love that city um, in the country. Sorry, we love that country. But it's... um. Yeah, we definitely need more time in Paris. So tonight we are um, trying to go to this R&B thing at this club because oh like God. we want just vibes and we want to go out with a bang. We want to spend our last moments just remembering the good times and um, looking forward to the next trip. So this has been an amazing six days. And um, yeah, I can't wait for tonight. I'm really excited and we better fucking, we better get ratchet. Cause we ain't got ratchet. Well, we kind of got a little bit of ratchet one day, <laughs> but we have no recollection of that. We have no, um, <laughs> we, got we, have, ratchet. we have no video footage of the ratchet, ratchet tree that happened. Want so, no footage that. <laughs> so yeah. Um, yeah. I'll catch you guys up when we get to our hotel back in London. <laughs>